Ooh, so we're gonna play a game that I have not played since I was in middle. middle school, high school. It's called Phantom Dust. I'm so excited. You can get this game for free in the Windows App Store. It's completely free. Really nice. So if you have nothing to do, you just have some spare time, go for it. Okay, Phantom Dust. I like this feel. It's like a post-apocalyptic game. Well, let's create a new client just to get started. Hmm. Well, my name is Silver, so I think I'll go with Silver. So, yeah, it's kind of difficult getting used to the controls, I feel. But, um... Huh. Okay, so we have to just go back, back. And you just use the keys on the up arrows, and you can just enter for backspace. And enter. Yeah, I'm not much of a video game person anymore. Uh, I played a lot when I was in middle school. Some when I was in high school and it just kind of died down. Most of us live, you know, as you grow up, it just you can't be playing video games all your life. It's just there's just too much to do in life to be stuck behind the screen. But it's fun to have a little hobby every now and then. All right, let's get started. Skill days are here. Visit Phantom Dust every day and sign in to Xbox Live to get a new multiplayer skill. Visit at least four days within the week to get a bonus multiplayer skill. Weekly reset is every Tuesday. Okay, cool. You've earned today's skill reward. Lost Dragon. Q more progress. Okay, cool. I just got a cool skill. See? Just by logging in. So scenario mode is basically story mode. So let's get started. Leader. The leader of the visions. Most have never heard of his voice. He communicates through Spokeman. Nobody remembers anything. Oh. Not when the world changed. No. Nor why. Okay. A mysterious dust poisoned the surface. It's just cool, everybody's... Affecting it's just, the brains I just love po post-apocalyptic stuff. It's really cool to me. Their memories. It's like a good UFO or something. Oh, gross. <laughs> Strange apparitions began to appear. Humans fled their devastated cities. Only underground could humans escape the demons and the dust. So the humans are pretty much like Super Saiyans now. Dragon Ball thing. The dust took from us, but to some, it gave something new. The ability to transform their will into energy. This is the breed. The espers risk their lives searching the surface world for clues. When I first watched this trailer when I was young, I was like, man, this is kind of cool. The that might let us and it really is. It's just really... We've lost. It's just kind of trying to solve a mystery. And what are these creatures, you know? What happened, what happened to society? Dragon Ball Did you turn into, uh, into a Goku?
And this girl who's like filming everything, she's like all sneaky about it. She's like, you can't find me, I'm the gingerbread girl. Man, that's cool. I don't know, think about it. What if in the future, some of us develop superpowers, like X-Men kind of style, you know? I don't know, I think it'd be kind of cool if we, if we can move stuff. Just look online and whatnot. He's like, what, what, what does this be? I don't know if any of you saw that, but she just saw that guy was wearing a picture of her. Interesting intro, interesting intro. Man. I don't know, tell me. If you guys... Aaron, if, if you like experience, I don't know, like a post-apocalyptic landscape one day, would you want to have like superpowers? Or would you like to be a mutant? Or would it be like zombies? I don't know. I must go. Go. This guy's like, I must go. Where am I going? I don't know, but I must go. He just wants to go. Let it go. Let it go. I must go. So let it go. Oh, oh. Wow. He's like, where am I? That's like me when I wake up every day. He's like, what? This guy's like, I have a hand? What? I've never seen a hand before. And there's a glove on it too. Huh. <laughs> they already hate each other. So Edgar's the other guy, the guy with the black hair. I'm not gonna lie. My favorite character, even though the main character is this guy, this guy doesn't talk whatsoever. So, hi, I am dressed like I am a punk rocker. I have no shirt on and just these weird straps. So that's kind of weird. Punk rocker, punk punk rocker. This guy's like, I don't have a name. Question mark, question mark, question mark. Where are we? First of all, where are we? Like, what is this? I'm like, I'm staring you down, boy. I know you. I think. I know you. Wait a minute. Who am I? Oh man, this guy's more confused than. And what is this place? Hey, tell me. Too many exclamations. What? You blocked your memory too? Man, this guy's like Thor the Explorer. I haven't even said anything. He's already like replying. Shoot. What the heck is going on? You tell me, what else I asked you a question? Okay, so am I allowed to leave, or what is this? Uh, I'm stuck in here! Ah! I'll, talk, I'll try to talk to him again. Right here has new dialogues. Hey, is that door open? <gasps> what in the world? Phoenix, we're the Ninja Turtles. Were you the 
one that brought us here? <laughs> it's like a freaking turtle. Got a turtle head. Why don't you tell us what happened? And this guy's like, I'm a cowboy. You've no memory at all, is that right? Just an image of some ancient ruins. And a strange gut feeling that you have to go there. I... But how did you know that? Everybody's the same, all of us. Now you. Please, follow me. There's 400 right there. Once we There's only 400 people alive. Huh. Like a cowboy and a ninja turtle. I have lost my mind. <laughs> Man, this game's like just movies. The whole thing's just like a movie. I'm just, I don't. I haven't even done anything. I'm just watching movies. It happened just like I told you. None of us remembers anything. We live in this world we don't understand, with people without memories wandering around, oh, with me. monsters roaming the surface More of these turtles. strange particles, and paranormal skills. I see. This place is like the lost and found counter at a catastrophe discount store. So, we lost sheep with no memory. Just like you. He's like, you got jokes, huh? There is one difference. The two of you were found in I'm strange jokes, metal though. pods. Look, girl, look at his nails. But leader says we are all lost souls. All we have left is this underground world and our scraps of memories and the image of the ruins in our heads. What a freaky looking guy. The ruins. The image I saw in my dream. Leader says oh, that's gonna be annoying. That the fact we all share the same image must be more than mere coincidence. We're all connected. It's like I'm in He's some weird right, cult. And so we are systematically searching the surface world for the ruins. And the main character's like, We hope uh, you can help with that search as well. Are Hello? you saying you want us to join the visions? We are very short-handed. Especially when it comes to people with skill. Oh, now we're going to become visions. But I am haunted by the ruins. Actually, I thought it was really cool. And, uh, for, a long, for a while, I was like, I'm a vision too. Back when I was like, a teenage, a preteen or whatever. Such a generous man is our leader. Leader says, Edgar, take your time. You don't mind us calling you Edgar, do you? We saw your locket too. You care about the woman in the photograph, don't you? Perhaps helping us will lead you to find her. And you. We should find a name for you as well. You need a name even if you don't have memories. Just pick a name that sounds good to He's you like, and we'll a call name? you that. What Everyone is that? Everyone picks their names here. Or perhaps you're one of the lucky ones who remembers his real name. Oh, I got a name. It seems you don't recall your name. Here are some options. Okay, what are your options? Based on the location where you two were found, we will call you Alpha. And it means where all things begin. It also means the unknown. Uh, no. I see. Okay. Okay. Ice is perfect for you. The capsule in which you two were found was frozen. Um, I ain't no iced tea. I see, okay, okay. Would you like to be known as age? It describes the flow of time. That's, that's like some hipster wannabe. I see, okay, okay. What do you think of key? It refers to the key for humanity. <laughs> oh, this guy's like rhyming like a Dr. Seuss wannabe. I see. Okay, okay. Perhaps you should be Jin. 
like a genie in the bottle. I mean, the beverage flavored by one of the officers who from La Pelea. That's not my name. That's not my name. They call me Gene. They say, okay. I say, yeah, would you like to consider Glenn? And I'm like, that's not my name. No, that's not my name. It's also the name of a beverage flip. Man, you're not gonna name me. Like, how about Coca Cola? It's the beverage of one of our favorite officers or whatever. I see. Okay, okay. Uh, you were rumored to be the savior. How about Cruz? In the ancient times, up to the level of were found near the savior, were called by this name. So you're, are you like a Christian cult now? Like, what in the world? No. I see. Okay, okay. Io. It's a good choice. Or is it low? It's the name of Wonder from ancient time. Low. Mm. Nah, I'm good. Mm. I'm good. Good. I'm good. I see. Okay. What do you think of air? It's the energy that keeps all of us alive on this earth. You mean oxygen? Mm. Cause not air. Mm. Air is just air. I see. Okay. Okay. You got. You got jokes. Well, how how Duke for you? This is a generic term refers to someone of high status. Although it might be wasted if I use it on you. How dare you insult me. I'm gonna take no trash from you. I see, oh see, okay, okay. Beard, what do you think of it? Oh uh, yeah, because I don't know the specifics, but I recall men with beards are considered very masculine. Okay, because my character obviously has a beard. I see, okay, okay. Silver, would you be perfect for you? The color of your hair. Well, I don't know if I would consider that as a compliment, but that is my name. I know. From now on, I'll call you Silver. That's your name. And that's how it happened, guys. Aaron, that's how my parents named me Silver. They took me some, some weird guys who look like turtle ninjas. And yeah. First thing first, go meet with Maester. Maester? The combat instructor. Hello, Meester. He's waiting for you too at the battle terminal. Okay, well, let's go to see the Meester. The Meester, the Meester. Are you the Meester? No, you're not the Meester. Who you are? Names are only for identification. My name is Three. Zero Three. Pretty simple, huh? I'm just like, <laughs> look at this guy. He's like. You? He disappeared! What in the world? Okay, anyway, these people are freaking out. Like, cool, here you go. Oh, here you go. Arthur Chunky. Your name be Chunky, boy? Boy, your name Chunky? Hey, rookie, I'm Chunky. Glad to meet you. Huh? I was just like, what? Okay. So, from, from what I recall, the battle terminal is over here. What I don't like about sometimes certain games, like this for example, they don't just tell you where to go. They're just like, hey, go to this place. And you're like, what, what, where's that? Oh, look, it's Edgar. I don't want to, but until we understand the situation, there's no other choice but to help. You should do the same. We can keep each other company and pass the time. Wink. Okay, well, Edgar, I'm leaving. Oh. Meester! Hello, Meester! Oh, it's you! What'd they say, true? You should have a look. Uh, I am Meester. Uh, but some people call me Mister. <laughs> the vision's combat instructor. I'll accompany you on the surface until I'm confident you can fend off for yourself. Huh. Okay. Can we just take a little glance? This is the battle terminal. The exit behind you leads to the surface. Here, you receive your missions. That mean that man there, Tetsuya. You to talk to him. Tetsuya. Hey, the black man. He'll assign you a mission. Hello, brother. How it is? Taking a mission. Let me explain how missions work. The visions do not allow underground dwellers to visit the surface. We scouts take care of all surface tasks. We call these missions. Let's see, let's see right now. Ah, there's a mission right here from Mr. From Mr. Mr. Ooh, palace. Okay. To the surface. We're gonna get 500 credits for doing this. 
You got what it takes. The next few lectures detail the attack and defense skills after this. You will understand you will understand the basics of combat. A partner has already been selected for the mission. Meester. My role as an instructor is to ensure the candidates make it back safely. You can depend on me. Okay, cool. So basically, I'm gonna be taught. Edgar, you and Edgar were both found in emergency capsules. Edgar, your are is to find the woman whose picture is in this locket. Wow, what a love story. When Meester's approval. I'm just calling him Mr. I'm sorry. Okay, Meester. Man. Mr. Red, he's angry. How do you like being on the surface again? I can't, I don't know what going Oh. Okay, so that's how you they teach you how to do stuff. Let's have to send to the camera again. So. Oh, okay. Beautiful sky, isn't it? Yes. This is creepy background music. Can you guys hear it? Aaron, can you hear that background music? Free K. It's what I miss most, living on the ground. That's why we need to find the ruins so we can go back to the surface for good. So basically this game is a whole go green campaign. It's led by liberal activists. Those were the cult leaders. First thing first, how how's your health right now? I'm telling you guys, it's go green. Go green or go home. That's why my character is glowing green. This guy's glowing red, I don't know why, but. The flash bar in the upper left corner is your health reader. Okay. When your health reaches zero, you fail the mission. Oh, you oh you die, or worse, expelled. The flashing number in the lower right corner is your energy level, called aura. Each skill requires a certain amount of aura to use. Okay, makes sense. The number below your aura number is your level, which reflects the number of aura particles you picked up. Huh, how can I pick up aura in real life? You know, that'd be kind of cool. Some attacks are. Some attacks are best avoided by moving out of the way. Oh, okay. Good job. Here's how to use my few skills. What's that noise? An enemy! To look at the enemy. Oh. Press the tab key. A little quick. This will lock. Don't play the enemy. Press the tab key. Oh, there we go. You have successfully locked onto the enemy. Ooh, what the the Obama. Hello, Obaro, Mr. Obaro. Okay. Deactivate your target lock. Yeah. I know it's your first time out, but I want you to join me. See that red capsule floating over on, up there yonder? It's a cluster of energized dust particles that contains an attack shell. Go over there and get it. Dear Dunn, I'll grab the model to me, grab the skill, and get to work. Okay. Move to the skill capsule. Alright. Oh, oh, freak! Mr. Mr. attacked me. What in the world? Okay. This is called capturing a skill. Now, capture the skill to the bottom. So I press. Oh. You have captured Bullet of Fire. I think I captured in the worst. Oh, there's a bullet of fire. Oh, cool. I captured in the right, right key. Oh, wow. I suck at this. Oh, there. Two damages. Come back here, eyeball. Oh, shoot. That's cool. Your aura will regenerate over time. You can float in the sky. You don't have enough aura to use this. You don't have enough aura. Yeah, we did it. You're right. Good job, my boy. Oh, he's a black man, too. 
cool. I like how games sometimes have different racial people, because then it's, I don't know, it just doesn't feel like a weird racist game. Attained a memory box. 03 is rep responsible for the machines mostly because he seems to remember a few things about computers. Huh, so if you know a few little things about something, then that's what you do. That's, that's your thing. That's your thing, boy. That's your thing, you're gonna talk to Mr. again. Hello, my master. Just as I thought, you two show the abilities far above everyone else. I'll prepare you for your next lecture. Go and see Tatsuya. Tatsuya. This guy's Tatsuya. Tatsuya. Man, I was just about to scratch my head. At the end there, there's a gate that allows you to go there so Don't use it without permission. Oh, what if I do? It's like permission. Highway. Watchful eye. Ooh. You passed your first test, so you know you have the potential to attend an Easter second lesson and learn to use multiple attacks and defensive skills. After this lesson, you should be good to go. Okay, Meester. Let's, let's see what I can learn from you. Meester, combat structure for new scouts. Okay, well, yeah. he uh, He's a leader of divisions. Meester is the nicest guy you're going to encounter. Win Mister's approval. Oh, cool! This is like a nice highway. I like this guy though. It's kind of cool. It's like it's a dust sky. Pollution. The Omaru is very active. It looks like we've got some moving around here. First, look. Okay. Right there. Time for some real world battle skills. First try out the different ranges of attack skills. Then you'll learn more about using defensive skills by the way you're on your own. First capture the skills. The blue is a defense skill and the red is an attack skill. Okay, pretty simple. First I'll unlock. Okay, I'm gonna put up. Ooh, the laser. Okay. Sounds good. I'll put the laser on my correct trigger. I'll put... Okay, so flash barrier. Flash barrier is a very high defensive skill. If you turn it right, it will defend you against attacks. Sounds good. Alright. Oh! What? They erased my other one. Rocket Sash is a short range attack. It is most accurate when your targeting reticle is orange. This skill can be used only once. Okay, well, I already lost. You have captured the skill. Move on to the target before well, attacking. Three, I lost all my skills, everybody. Okay, so another bullet of fire. Let's see, okay, now I'm gonna have multiple skills. Okay, lock on, lock on, lock on, lock on. Laser. Oh, that's some damage. Down. You're better than I thought. I think you're right for assist me in the next battle. Now let's head back to town. Let's get back down. Say well, people say well. Let's get back to town. Say, oh, I got so many credits. Spokeman, the only person who can speak directly to leaders. Spokeman communicates all of the leaders' thoughts. Sounds like. 
Sucks. All right, well, I think we'll stop for right now until the next recording. So I think we'll just end the game right here. And do you want to save or exit? Okay.